long bushy tail try to see that because that was the reason why this monkey oh, should be no. should be overhunted right oh, they, they just wanted the tail to export the tail for dusters oh, imagine wrong. that imagine that just kill a monkey just to cut their tails off yeah and that's why since that time because a lot of pressure on this species so they become very uh, like a elusive uh -huh. yeah very shy also but because this is a reserve also they are actually recovering their numbers in these last years little by little and actually we have the chance to once in a while to see this species we're very lucky yeah saki monkey an endemic species of the pacaya samiria national reserve there is another species that is called the monk saki but that one is living at the other side Macos, look at that the scarlet maco wow
right? Mixed blood, Spanish and Indian, and their ancestry, right? But they, in the Amazonas, even now in this time, actually exist one or two indigenous people. They've never been in touch with the rest of the people. They live deep inside the forest. They don't accept any people coming to their territory. They can be killed, right? And there is no other way to go to those places. That's only the place where they already were integrated to the society possible to visit. Probably we are going to have opportunity or chance to visit some of those communities on our way going down. So we are going to see closely how the people is living, what kind of things they eat, and what kind of plants they are growing, the places, all the things we are going to, to, to see from these people. because they feed in small creatures with water. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Wow. Okay. Wow. Let's help this and make the I'm going to put it back in there. Okay. In the okay. All right. Vamos. A tierra Thank rápido. Thank you for your time. Thank you. 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 The name of this community is called Warmi Island or Girl Island is the name of this small community of about uh, 70 people living in here, right? All the community, they do focus on fishing. That's the main activity for them. Look at the Hornet Screamer. We yeah. saw Hornet Screamer from farther this time. There's yeah. one down here, look. Oh, 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 wow. Oh, oh, my God. It take, oh, my God. That was a great black hawk, right? Yeah. Look at that. Take it, Sansi. Look. Many things, many places. Wow. See, the Hornet Screamer is a juvenile. It's a young one because they do morning eating from the vegetation as a major before. Right? Look. I can tell because it's a young one because no.
That's the monkey high. Look at the other one with the baby. There's another lady carrying baby. Oh my goodness! Oh, you see? Yep. Oh my goodness! He jump, he just fall in the water, and he just climb very fast. Oh my gosh! Water is dangerous, right? Yeah, yes, it is. Yes, come over here, okay, senor. Okay, you could get a photo. Photo for that close, that would be there. Beautiful photo. Try to get a photo with the eggs and also when he's popping his wings. Stretching his arm, yep. yeah, it's all tired. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's right now. Yeah, he's stretching his arm right now. He's stretching his arm right now. You can stand up if you want. Stand up. See, he's also being attacked by mosquitoes, that's why he's just scratching his arm. <laughs> Also. When he's just like that, when he's moving, normally his main predator is the heart, the eagle. The, heart, the largest eagle to like to use. You know?
Because you need to stay behind the light, otherwise you won't see it. And there you go, you see? 